All right, I like that right there. Let's get ready to turn this thing up and get it started. Going to come out of the gate right now. We're coming out of the gate. Headland Bass team right here. Great. Hardy, Lawson, Campbell. They're bringing us five to the scales today in that VMC weigh-in bag. I will tell you, these VMC weigh-in bags were very deceiving all week. Those five today. Your weight today? Nine pounds, 15 ounces. Get some pictures right there. Good job. Nine pounds, 15 ounces. Benchmarked it right here for Gamble and Hardy out of Headland Bass Team. All right, you guys watch how they did that now out in front, okay? You guys watch it. Hardy getting loud right there. Look at this right here. There's a good one. Hardy and Gamble, Headland Bass Team right there. New leader right now, one in the box. All right, take that right there, give it a quick dip, get right there, go all the way back to the release boat. All right, next up, Dixie County Bass Masters. It's Landon and Kobe Burke, the Burke brothers right here. Too shy of a limit today. Too shy, just got to be in that top three spot today out of 34. Turn around, everybody on Bassmaster.com watching. Those three today, four pounds, 15 ounces. Just got to be in that top three when the scales close the day. The Burke Brothers from Cross City, Florida. Absolutely. Good job right there, Dixie County Bass Master. Good job, man. They're putting them in there. Give it a dip right there. Grab your ticket. All right, good job right there, getting this thing going. Central Florida Youth Anglers, Ty Cooper and Landon McLaughlin right here. Bringing two today. Looks like he's got two. He looks like, oh, boy, he went to the fish market in that bag. I've seen something. These two fish right here. Needs 10 pounds or better to take the lead. New leader, 11 pounds, 12 ounces. We got ourselves a fan freak of nature in that bag in there. That's a Lake Harris chain of bass right there. Oh, boy, y'all better get loud. Look at this giant bass. Boom. Who says these juniors can't fish? Yesterday, the college guys weighed in at 10-14. I'm excited to see where this is going to take. You might need, you, we might need to rename you, man. Might need to rename you. What's your personal best? Is your personal best? Is your personal best? Not anymore. Big bass right here to hold and see if it holds. What do you think it weighs? Okay, let's see. He says eight or nine. How about nine pounds, nine ounces? What? Somebody just set the bar real high on a big bass for the Harris Chain of Lakes right here out of Leesburg, Florida. Thanks to Lindsey McBride and the Greater Sports Commission of Orlando. Thank you guys so much for having us all week. It's been an awesome time right there. Okay, do me a favor. All right. I'm going to get it right. Ray County Eagles. Anglers, come on up. Jackson Ray. T.J. Murray. They're bringing us one shy of a limit today. All right, turn around. Everybody on Bassmaster.com at home. See your faces, those four today. Three pounds, eight ounces right there. Hold up those fish right there for the Eagle Anglers. Spring City, Tennessee. Big shout out to... Hey, and thank you guys for coming all the way down here fishing with us, too. I appreciate that, guys. Good job. Absolutely. Ray County. Good job. Good job. Next up, Columbia High School, Claybo Berry, William Sykes. Too shy of a limit there today. Claybo and William, these three today, four pounds, nine ounces. 
Columbia High School Junior Anglers right there. We like to let all these junior guys hold up some fish. That's, that's what they do here. It's where it starts. You can't have a good varsity football team without a good JV football team, basketball, whatever sport it is. Nassau Christian Bass Club, Caleb Jackson, Everett Hunter. And they're bringing five. Oh, boy. These guys are out of Nassau Christian up around the Jacksonville, Florida area. St. Augustine, turn around. These five today looking for something bigger than 11-13. New leader, 13, 13, 13 pounds, 13 ounces for Caleb Jackson and Everett Hunter out of St. Augustine, Florida. Oh, boy, good job right there. Ty Cooper dropping a nine-pound, nine-ounce bass on the scales today for the Big bass thus far. Good job right there. Put him right there. Grab your ticket. Good start right there. Mid-Florida Youth Anglers on the junior side. Harold Walls and Hunter Schrader. One shy of a limit today. The benchmark right now for the lead, 13-14. Here we go. Let's see what we got. This is what you need to take the lead. Mid-Florida Youth Anglers right here. Harold and Hunter. Six pounds even. Six pounds even right there for Harold Walls and Hunter Schrader. Again, thank you, moms, dad, everybody that's traveled all over the country to come over here and fish with the on this Bassmaster stage right here. We appreciate you guys, absolutely. Good job, guys. Put them right there. Grab your ticket right there on the scales. Fuquay Varna Middle School. Grady and is it Karan? Karen? Kieran. Okay, come on up, Kieran Stevenson. How do you pronounce that? Is it Fuquay? Fuquay, all right. You got three in the tank today in a bag. Three pounds, ten ounces right there for Grady and Kieran. I got you. All right, a little cold back home. All right, it snows. All right, two days ago. Felt like it was going to snow here last night. Good job, guys. Absolutely good job. Next up is West Elementary, Hunter Brakefield. Let's hear it for Hunter. Hunter, you went out by yourself today, didn't you? Yeah, all right. Give me some of that right there, man. That's honorable, dude. Let's get loud for Hunter Brakefield. 12 ounces right there. Hold this fish up, man. Good job. 12 ounces. There you go. Good job. <laughs> Let's get loud one time. All right. Here you go, right here. Put that back in there. Stay real. Hey, come here real quick. Hey, come here real quick. Hey, I want to say thank you because you know what? That means you didn't quit. You could have got discouraged and said, I'm dad. I want to go in. This ain't fun no more. It's too cold. I'm out here. He fell asleep. You're tired. But, hey, give me some of that right there, dude, because that says a lot. You What? Come on. See, he almost came in. But guess what? You got a fish, and you got on the board. That's what it's all about. First Academy, Leesburg, Cody Rojas and Landon Haynes. Come on up. They're bringing two to the scales today for Haynes and Rojas. First Academy out of Leesburg. Those two, three pounds, 14 ounces. Parents, that's something that you just you just can't put in these kids. There's no quit in them. That's awesome. Got to praise and reward those guys. It's easy. When you got one fish out there, you're beating yourself up, and you don't want to you want to throw in the towel. They didn't. Awesome job. Next up is Junior Southwest Bassmasters. Come on up. Elijah, come on up. Ledbetter. You got three today. Elijah, you went out by yourself too, right here? There you go. Put them right there. Good job. Give me some of that right there. Turn around and let everybody see you right there on Bassmaster.com. Those three today, two pounds, 12 ounces. Good job, man. Good job. Absolutely. Good job. Mid-Florida Youth Anglers, Jack, Jack Kennedy, and Kaysen Campbell. Oh, come on up right here. Put them right there. There you go. They're bringing two to the scales today. There you go. Come on up. Jack Kennedy and Kaysen Campbell. Mid-Florida Youth Anglers. Turn around so everybody can see you on Bassmaster.com. Those two fish today. Two 
two pounds, nine ounces. Hold those up right there. Good job right there, Mid-Florida Youth Anglers. If it was called catching, everybody would do it. You guys went out this morning in 40-degree temperatures and stuck it out all day on a tough fishery. Good job. The cold front shut them down a little bit, but you guys did a great job. Good job, guys. Next up, Ray County Eagle Anglers. Owen, Ray, Camden, Cranefield, come on up. They're bringing us five fish here today in that VMC weigh-in bag. Just turn around and let everybody out there see you right there. Bassmaster.com, Mom, everybody right there. Those five going to go today. Eight pounds, eight ounces. Ray County, Eagle Anglers, Tennessee. Very popular area up there, Ray County. Right around Chickamauga, there you go. Good job right there. Hanging on to a 9-9. Nine nine. Hanging on to a 9-9 nine nine right there. Okay, I cut your bag off. There you go. And then just uh, grab your ticket on the way down the stairs. Tomlin, come on up. Aiden and Max, come on up. Aiden Griffin and Max Stansel. They're bringing five fish to the scales today. Anything big? You need 13-14 to take over the lead. Turn around, everybody can see you. Those fish today, 8 pounds, 14 ounces. 8 pounds, 14 ounces right there. For Aiden Griffin and Max Stansel, Plant City, Florida. Thank all the sponsors out there, everybody that helps us out. Strike King's been here. Be sure to go by the Strike King they're our title sponsor for the college series. So, anglers, feel free to go over there. Take advantage of that strike, King. I think you Google or text something, you might get some prize or get a get a rod or get a line or something. I don't know. He'll do something over there. Mark's a good guy. Mark, thanks for sticking around all weekend. Strike King, thank you so much for being that title sponsor for the college series. Mount Juliet Fishing, come on up here. Michael Harris and Cannon White. They're bringing three to the scales today. Bringing three to the scales today. Turn around there. Everybody's looking for you right out there. Look out there. Three fish today for Michael and Cannon. Four pounds, nine ounces. Good job, guys. A little cold this morning? A little chilly? A little, not, not quite as cold as in Tennessee? Maybe not, no. Okay. Mount Juliet fishing right there. Michael Harris and Cannon White. Good job, guys. Here you go. Next up, Meadow Lane, Central Florida Youth Anglers. Come on up. Zach Slowinski and Michael Petridis right there out of West Melbourne, Florida. They're bringing three to the scales today. Bringing threes to the scales today. We got one on crutches right here. Come on up here. Zach, come on over this way. Face that way. Turn around and look at. Yeah, there you go. I'm impressed that he did that. That's pretty awesome. Those three fish for you guys today. Four pounds, six ounces. Good job, man. Good job. Crutches and all. Hard work pays off. Meadows Lane's. Central Florida Youth Anglers, Zach Slowinski, and Michael Petridis. Three bass limit today for four pounds, six ounces. Ty Cooper done put a big old nine, nine on the scales today for big bass. Some, unless somebody brings one up less than that or a little bit more than that, it's going to be something big. Good job. All right, grab your ticket right here on the way out. Iowa Youth Fishing League, Lane Lewis and Grant Knorr. Bringing three to the scales today. I saw these guys at registration yesterday. Come on up here, man. Bassmaster.com on there. Give me some of that, dude. Good seeing you today. A little chilly today? All right. Yeah, it was. Five pounds, four ounces. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, I like that right there, a little fist pump. That's what I'm talking about. Iowa Youth Fishing. You came a long ways, my friend, from West Des Moines. And Grimes, absolutely. Grant and Lane. Good job, guys. And thank you guys for coming all the way down here fishing with us, too. 
definitely hope to see you guys maybe uh, next stop at the junior and high school open. That would be awesome. Good job. Scoot over to your left. Get you guys on Bassmaster.com later. Check that photo shoot out. There you go. Some proud parents right there. Good job. Next up, Hard Knocks, Titus Thompson and Brant Thompson. Team Thompson, they're bringing five to the scales a day. 13-14, you'd be the new leader. See how far up the leaderboard we can get Titus and Brant right here. Your weight, eight pounds, three ounces. Currently sitting in sixth place right now for Titus and Brant. Good job. Killer-looking shirts, man. Sporting that Spro buff. Thanks out to the folks at Spro. Good job. Your team, not your team, let's get loud for these anglers. Good job. North Florida Christian, Dusty Wicks and Gavin Jones. North Florida Christian, Dusty Wicks and Gavin Jones. Turn around right there. Let everybody see. You got one in the box today. That one today. One pounds, 11 ounces right there. Come on over here and hold that thing up, Dusty. Good job, man. Even at this age right here, they are competitive. Stone cold competitors right there, my friend. There will be better days. Don't get all upset. You'll be fine. Mount Pleasant Bass Team Juniors. Talon, Ashworth, and Peyton Davison. They got three from Columbia, Tennessee and Summertown, Tennessee. Turn around. Let everybody see you. Mom, Dad, everybody out there in Bassmaster.com. Three fish. Four pounds, six ounces. Four pounds, six ounces right there. Currently sitting in 12th place. We had 34 teams go out today. The top three punched their ticket to the 2022 Junior Bass Master National Championship presented by Academy Sports. So that's worth something to come down here. Get yourself into the box. All right, next up, Tampa Bay Junior Bass Club, Dominic Andux and Nathan Greco. They're bringing three to the scales today. Too shy of a limit, but looking for something. 13, 14, you take the lead. Looking for something to get you up there when the scale's closing in the top three. Those three today? Eight pounds, 10 ounces. Currently in fifth place. Fifth place right there for Dominic and Nathan Greco. Good sack of fish right there. Too shy of a limit. Next up, Club Florida High School Bassmasters on the junior side. Nicholas Kerr, Jordan Marshall. Here you go, right here in this bag, guys. There you go. Go back to the release boat. Nicholas, you're welcome. Thank you guys for fishing with us, man. We appreciate that. Club Florida High School Junior Bassmasters. Those five bass limit today. Seven pounds, six ounces. Got you sitting currently in eighth place right now for Club Florida. High school bass masters right there on the junior side. These VMC weigh-in bags got a got stretched out a little bit the last couple of days. And these junior anglers are putting them to work today as well. Putting a little weight in these bags today. Ty. McLaughlin right there. He's holding on to that 9-9. Nine, nine. Mount Pleasant. Come on up, Tristan and DJ. I got you guys. Come on up. They're bringing three. Too shy of a limit today. Mount Pleasant. Come here. Give me some of that, man. Come on. Get some smiles up there. Turn around a little bit. It's going to have better days. I promise you. Four pounds, 13 ounces. Four pounds, 13 ounces. Currently sitting in 12th place right now. These guys right here, man, I'm going to tell you, you can tell these kids right here, this is serious. They're, when they stumbed their toe, man, it's like they took the skin back. They're a little upset. Trust me, these are competitors. These anglers are serious about this stuff. They love it. Absolutely. Good job. You stayed in the game. You had a lot of issues out there, I understand. But you finished the game, right? You stayed in and you finished the game. Off the hook, Bassmasters, Braden, Rivest, and Christopher Volp, is it? 
Volpe, okay, come on up. They're one shy of a limit. Looking for 13-14 to take the lead. Here on the Junior Bassmaster stage today, presented by Academy Sports on this open out of Harris Chain, Florida. Four pounds, 11 ounces. The Harris Chain's been good to everybody, catching some fish. Leesburg's been awesome to everybody. The hotels, the lodging, the restaurants, everybody, the park. Thanks to Miss Lindsay McBride with the Great Orlando Sports Commission. Thank you guys for helping us out. The ramps, the facility. I know registration, like John mentioned a little bit, but this is the process that they're going to do when they go to college, when they go to the, the nation, to the Opens, on to the Elite Series. This is exactly what they do. We're just getting them ready. Here you go. You. you got it, guys. Good job. Thank you, guys. Mid-Florida Youth Anglers, Connor Kennedy and Brentley West bringing three fish to the limit. And the only reason why I know this is because they were in fishing for us last year, and they weighed in 22 pounds here last year. Turn around so everybody can see on Bassmaster.com. Those fish, there you go. Those three are going to go for six pounds, four ounces. Connor and Brentley, they sacked 22 pounds here last year, punched their ticket to the Junior Nationals up in Carroll County. Six pounds, four ounces, Mid-Florida Junior Anglers. All right. Real quick, real fast, I'll just leave them right there for a second. Real quick. Hey, real quick, come here. I know you don't like this whole, whole but I'm going to let you say something. Hey, what did it mean to you last year to put 22 pounds here but compete from here to the Junior Nationals last year? It meant the world, but it it was tough today, but it meant the world. It was the coolest thing ever, going to Tennessee. It's it's crazy fishing up there. You can you can catch 40 in a day. Sometimes. All right, all right. Well, come on over here. Anybody want to say hello or thank you, too, because you were there last year. It was fun, right? Mm-hmm. All right, how about it? Mm -hmm. You want to say hello to Mom or anybody just one time? Uh, hello, Mom? Hello. Okay, there you go. That's it. That's all you're going to get from them. I know that. Here. <laughs> All right. This is the, what drives me to do what I do because these kids are competitive. You don't see, I mean, you see it, but you don't feel it. You can feel it up here. There's a different feel up here. Tampa Bay Junior Bassmasters, Luke Ayat and Johan, they're bringing three to the scales today. These guys, oh, hey, what's up, man? Good job. Good dude. Good seeing you guys. All right. Those three today for you guys, three pounds, six ounces for Luke and Johan. Hold those up, guys. We have more junior open, so don't let this be the last one. You got as good a shot as anybody when you show up. If you don't show up, you don't have a shot. So come down on the trail. Follow us on the Junior Bassmaster Open Trail and come see us. We'll be there. Come see us. Get your ticket right there at the end right here. Good job. McKeel Academy of Technology. Brock Lovering in Dallas Heard. They're bringing us four fish today, one shy of a limit. Needing to get in that top three when the scales close today for Herd and Lovering. Nine pounds, six ounces. Nine pounds, six ounces right now for Brock Lovering and Dallas Herd. Currently sitting in fourth place, but you got a good, good representation today for Brock Lovering and Dallas Herd from McKill Academy Technology. Absolutely. Okay, good deal. Yep. Yep. All right, put these in here real quick. I'm going to talk to them just real quick. Hey, look, here, real fast. Here, put that in there. Okay, hey, listen. Th this is why I'm going to ask you this, because this is the part of the sport. Come on over here, man. You can get on this side, too. This is part of the sport that w when you leave here today, this is what's going to be on your mind. Did I miss a fish today that probably kept me because right now you're sitting in fourth place? Did I miss a fish today? Did I capitalize? Did I not execute? Did I fish clean? Because these are the questions. But if you fish clean, you didn't miss anything. You did what you could do. You dealt with what you was dealt. Did you miss anything today, Brock? Yeah, I mean, it was a grind, but we missed like four fish, and they probably could have helped. Okay, so it's going to sting a little bit, but it won't be the last time we see you on this stage because, buddy, I'm going to be here as long as they can if they have to put me up there on a walker. Come on over here, man. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Uh, thank you to our sponsors, of course, but, um, you know, thank you to Andrew for taking us out today. Uh, I know it's tough because he had two college tournaments. Right. Um, but, yeah, then just thank you to boat captains, everything. You got it, man. All right, take your fish right there. Grab your ticket right here, Brock. 
All right. Last team. Is this our last team? Yep. So if I can bring up the leaders, Jackson Hunter from Nassau Christian Bass Club. Are you local right here? You guys close? Come on up. Come on around. We're going to bring you guys up. Yep. You got it. Come on up, Jackson and Hunter from Nassau Christian. Come on up here. Come on. This, you guys ain't, ain't. Come on over here. Stand on this side of me. Nope. Stand on that side. All right. So what we're going to do is, is hey, you, you guys got a little. I think the last conversation I said there was something about you. Remember that? But that was at another tournament. But something good about you guys. But, hey, get some thank yous in real quick and uh, see how this thing goes right now. And maybe you can crown that. Take home that, you and your boat captain. So when we're done here, we'll get ready to crown you. We'll make sure your boat captain comes up as well. We're going to send some hardware home with him as well. But, hey, get some thank yous in. Uh, I want to thank my mom, my dad, for allowing me to do this. I want to thank the Lord Almighty for giving us the opportunity to fish in this gorgeous weather here in Florida. I mean, it's 18 inches of snow where I'm from, but not here in Florida. You don't have to deal with snow. But I also want to thank you for running this for everybody to enjoy their time out in the water and catch fish. Absolutely. Good job, man. Who would you like to say thank you to? How did you catch? What did you catch your fish on today? Red bug finesse worm. All right. Good deal. Well, who would you like to say thank you or hello to out there? I'd like to say thank you to my mom and dad because they're the only, the only reason I'm able to do this. So, And uh, I'd like to thank you for uh, putting on such a great event every time, every single time. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. Step over here just to this side. All right. And then we'll get your boat captain to come on up because right now you guys are the leaders. All right. Next up. Next up, let me get over here out of Alabama, floor, out of Alabama. Col Col yep, I am. Columbia, Alabama, and Headland, Alabama. Come on up here. Leave your bag there. Come on up, John and Hayes. Come on up. All right, come on up. Headland, Alabama. Pretty soon you're going to be seeing a blue tundra running around old Birmingham somewhere around there. I got to move up there. You got any recommendations? Talk to me when we're done today. How's that? Is that cool? Okay. I'm moving your neighborhood. How's that? That's good. Cool. I like that. <laughs> All right, man. Hey, anybody, you, uh, how'd you catch your fish today? Let's ask you, what bait did you use today on the Harris chain? I used a blue flake black zoom worm. Uh, you know what? That was a good choice, my friend. Absolutely. You want to say thank you to anybody and anything like that out there? Who would you want to talk to? Uh, I'd like to thank the Lord, my mom and dad, and my boat captain. <laughs> Give me some of that right there. You're raising them right. Anything you want to say? To, where's mom at? All right, Mama's right there. She cooked good. Oh, yeah. Okay, because I like to hear that because I'm going to be up there a little while, and my wife's watching, so I'm going to have to have somebody cook for me, you know what I mean? Maybe get a little invite or something. Is that all right? Yes, sir. All right. Anyways, who would you like to say hello or thank you to? I'd like to thank the good Lord Almighty for letting us be here today. I'd like to thank my sponsors, and I'd like to thank my boat captain. Absolutely. Okay, go over there and go get your fish. Go back and get your fish, and let's see how this thing's going to shake out. I'm not for sure, but... We're going to see right here. Headland Bass Team, John Parker Deal and Hayes Henderson. Come on up. They're going to put this in the scales today. The these VMC weigh-in bags, they got a two bass limit. If it's not 13, 14, you are the champs. Your weight today, 2.13. Let's hear it for Nassau Christian. There's your champions of the day. Hunter and Jackson out of Nassau Christian Junior Club right there. Get your pitcher. You guys step over. Where's your boat captain? We'll have your boat captain come on over. Hey, good job. Step right over there on this side right here. We'll get a picture of you. Hold that out there. Good job. Let's give a big round of applause for all these junior anglers out here. Did an amazing job, guys and gals. Amazing job. All right, let's do this right here. Your ticket's going to print. Go take those back to the release boat. Here, take these back with you, and then grab your ticket. You three, come on up over here, and we'll do the scales right here. So your winners today, your champions of the first stop of the Bassmaster Junior Stop right here on the Harris Chain of Lakes out of Leesburg, Florida, presented by Academy Sports, is Caleb Jackson and Everett Hunter. Nassau Christian Bass Club brought in a five-bass limit for 13 pounds. 13 ounces. Let's hear it for them. All right. Okay, you guys got to stand right there on that X. And y'all seen the Elite Series stage? Y'all see how they do it? You put it, there you go. 
There it is right there. This is the platform will get you there. You stay on track. This is the platform that will get you there to fulfill your dreams with the hard work and the dedication from you guys. All right, good job, man. So you know what? Here's the cool thing about it is I'm going to, you know, here's we didn't do trophies for second and third. Okay, it's just because I had to give a little something to, in order to get a couple national bursts. So I'm going to go ahead and t name the next two teams up. If you guys will just kind of ease off to the stage. I do real quick want to call up the next two teams because these two teams are going and punch their ticket to the 2022 Junior National Championship. Second place today, weighing in two fish, weighed in 11 pounds, 12 ounces, Ty Cooper and Landon McLaughlin. You can come right here. You can come here. And they punched their ticket. They punched their ticket to the 2022 Junior Nationals. So here's the cool thing about it is, all right, man. So now the burden's been lifted off of you a little bit. And you caught, and actually you got the big bass of the day, a 9-9, nine, nine, man. So that's pretty good because you know what that did? That, that was second biggest bat of this weekend behind the college. Who would you like to say thank you to real quick? I'd like to say thank you to my boat captain, my mom, and my sponsors, which are Bass Gorillas and more. Okay, so your boat captain is who? Ryan Cooper. Okay, and he would be who? The best gorilla person. Maybe your dad. <laughs> and today is his and and today is his birthday. Yes, sir. Yeah, so here's what we got to do. A real real quick. Do I got time? Real fast. Do I got a little bit? Do I got a here on the count of three? Real quick, Chris. I'm still good, right? So on the count of three, come on up here, man. Come on up here. <laughs> All right, come on up here. Hey. This is what it's about, whether it's a granddad, an uncle, somebody filling in because of somebody doesn't have a dad or whatever happened, whatever the case is, a parent, single parent, whatever. This is what this is about. You stand in the gap. Regardless, you're all standing in the gap for these kids, and this is what it's about. So, hey, who you want to say hello, thank you to before he sings his dad happy birthday? My partner, my captain, Bass Gorillas, and my family. Absolutely. Okay. On the count of three, we won't do the whole birthday thing, but we're going to do the, the – got to get the tune low. Happy birthday to you. Can we do it? All right, so let's all join in, but you got to start it. All right, on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to daddy. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Awesome. Come here, man. Real quick, you're welcome, man. Come here, listen. I know it's a proud moment. You guys put in a lot of sacrifices. I, I've known you guys for a few years. So it's pretty awesome now. They got a national berth going to the nationals, which is awesome. They're going to finish out in the state level. Proud dad, proud moment, birthday. This is probably the best birthday present maybe this, this young man could have probably given you, right? That, that's right, just right there at the top for sure. I know you're, you, you're a big guy. This guy's a big dude. There's a Bass Gorilla. He owns Bass Gorilla Base, but, hey, look, he's a big guy. But I know right now you're, you're, it's, you're touched emotionally, and I like that, man. And I think that's awesome. So let's hear it one more time. Congratulations on you punching your ticket. And happy birthday, my friend. Good job. Absolutely. All right. You're welcome. Back. You guys can go this way right here, okay? Next up, they got a third spot to last spot in the Junior Nationals. You can go ahead and go back. You're good. The third spot to the Junior Nationals in 2022. Gray Hardy, Lawson, Gamble, Headland, Bass Team. The trip was worth it, right? Absolutely. So now you can go back to Alabama. You can go back and fish all those other events right there, fish free, right? Get some points if you're fishing for team of the year, anything like that. Who would you like to say hello or thank you to out there? Because now you got another national spot. So now you're fish the rest of the season kind of loose free, right? Yes, sir. I'd like to thank my boat captain, my dad, and for my parents bringing me here and, from, and for my partner and for God keeping us safe out on the water today. I can't believe it. Absolutely. Come on up here, Lawson. Who would you like to say hello or thank you to? I'd like to say thank you to the Lord, Tri-Delta, and I'd like to say thank you to my boat captain, Philip Gamble, and my partner. Awesome, man. You know, I'm looking forward to moving to Alabama. I really have. I've had that territory with Toyota for about 15 years, and I tell you, I'm looking forward to uh, moving up there. There's some good folks up there, so if we see you around or something, we'll hit the pond, or you can probably hit me up and say, hey, this is a good place to eat and all that good stuff. 
All right, made me feel at home, my friend. Congratulations, you guys got a last spot right there. This is the third three spots today, so congratulations to all the winners. I'm going to get back to top ten. I'm going to go ahead and give, let everybody know on the top ten. We'll go ahead. I'll start from the bottom. Connor Kennedy and Brentley West, Mid-Florida Youth Anglers. They weighed in three fish today, six pounds, four ounces. Ninth place, Nicholas Kerr and Jordan Marshall. They weighed in seven pounds, six ounces. Eighth place, Titus Thompson, Brant Thompson. Hard knocks. They weighed in a five bass limit for eight pounds, three ounces. Owen Ray and Camden. Seventh place, weighed in eight pounds, eight ounces. Sixth place, Dominic Andux and Nathan Greco. Three bass limit today for eight pounds, ten ounces. Aiden Griffin and Max Stansel. Fifth place, five bass limit today for eight pounds, 14 ounces. Brock Loverney and Dallas Hurd, McKeel Academy Technology. Weighed in four bass limit today, nine pounds, six ounces. Separation right there. Nine ounces from that third place spot. Gray Hardy, Lawson Gamble. They got a they got a spot today for the Nationals. Headland Bass Team, five bass limit, nine pounds, fifteen ounces. Ty Cooper and Landon McLaughlin. And plus they uh, Landon had the biggest bag of the day so far. Nine pounds, nine ounces. Awesome job right there, Ty Cooper and Central Florida Youth Anglers. And taking home the top prize in the hardware today in another spot to Nationals was Caleb Jackson and Everett Hunter out of Nassau Christian Bass Club. Five bass limit for thirteen pounds. 13 ounces. Stick around. We're going to change this setup a little bit and get ready for the high school anglers.